primer will naturally help your makeup last longer and not crease or break down throughout the day. I'm using one that has salicylic acid to help with the acne and it's also oil controlling. Once the primer is set, I like to go in with a concealer. Some people like to do their concealer over foundation, um, but because for me, I have a very difficult skin tone, I like to put my concealer under just to make sure that my color is perfectly matched. So I'm going to actually be using the cream here, and the way I use it is I just take a little bit out, and I actually warm it up on my hands. This kind of helps to um, make it a very workable texture, and it helps it kind of layer and build onto the skin where I need the coverage most. When it comes to concealer, some people do like to use a brush. I personally prefer to use my hands. The next part of concealer that I'm going to use is the Smooth Indulgence Under Eye Concealer. As you can see, um, when I'm a little bit sleepy and when I haven't been eating too healthy, I definitely suffer from under eye bags. And what's great about this is that not only does it cover well, but it really gives a luminous finish. So when you put it underneath your eyes, it actually brightens them up and makes you look more awake. And next, I'm going to move on to foundation. I'm using the Smooth Indulgence Foundation, and the reason that I love this is that it's a medium to full coverage foundation, so you can build upon it depending on how much coverage you need. Um, and it gives kind of a matte finish to the skin. You can also add a little bit of dew if you need to, but it's great for covering acne or for covering pigment or any other imperfections. So there's nothing worse than finishing your foundation and trying to move on to blusher, you know, a little bit of contour and realizing that your blush and contour are removing the foundation that you've just worked so hard to apply. So what I like to use is a setting powder. This is a setting powder that literally makes your makeup last all day and all night long. So what I'm gonna do is just take this on a very big fluffy brush and ever so lightly tap this on. And then after I've tapped a full application, I can go in and just very, very lightly buff. Next, I'm going in with the Quick Fix Illuminator, and this is an awesome little product in a convenient little pen. You can just twist up to take out some of the product for application. I'm going to put a little bit just into the inner corner of my eyes, and this is going to make them look bright and awake. Since this is a light color, it's going to extend my eyes, um, so that it really makes them pop and glow, and just really shows off your natural eye color. I'm also going to use this a little bit on the outer side of my eyes. Next, we all want those beautiful sculpted cheekbones, so I'm just going to dispense a little bit of product and apply this right where I would apply a cheek highlighter. I like to do just three little dots. I like to do them kind of in a diagonal line underneath my eye on top of my cheekbone. And I'm just going to use my finger to blend these in and make my cheek look really highlighted and really defined. And we can also apply some to our lips to make them look poutier and a little bit fuller. Next, you can go ahead and apply your eyes or apply any blush or contour that you want and you can be on your way.